Ooh. Happy Easter. Yeah, happy Easter, everyone. Light tonight. Oh. Yeah, you can see the see the light behind you. It's not dark anymore. I know I've got the curtains open. It's brilliant. I love light tonight. <laughs> Last. Yeah. Oh, it's the uh, yeah. I'm wondering if everyone remembers that the clocks went um went forward. Um I did. I yeah, did. well obviously it does it automatically on the phones and the watches and stuff. The microwave I had to do. And uh, um the the clock at the side of my bed I had to do and that was it. We just had one clock and that was it. All the others are <laughs> automatic, so Yeah, everything else in the house is automatic. There's only a few things. Oh um and I've actually um oh funny funny that that's I've just seen I thought I might have to change the time on this. Uh yeah, you probably will have to. Yeah. That's just sitting here. That's the old Night Rider watch. Yeah. So did you get any Easter eggs? Yeah. Uh, well, no, I'm diabetic, so I can't. Oh, right, okay. So I, we've done it for about what about eight years now. Um, I just get a really nice jar of coffee. All oh, right. Okay. No booze, no nothing. Just a nice jar of coffee that lasts me a few. It lasts longer than an Easter egg in this household. Yeah. Oh, so. who's that? Oh, Kirsty wants the laptop charger. <laughs> ah, right. Want the laptop charger? Yeah. There we go. All right, she's got it. <laughs> go. Right. Um. Yeah. So, um, I've been a little bit dead this week. Not much happening. Yeah. My my end. Um. On Thursday, we had the 66 turn up and Optimus Prime. Um, but, yeah, obviously, because the bank holiday on Friday, I would imagine there's going to be a delay in a lot of mail. Yeah. Uh, because people at Royal Mail don't go back to work until Tuesday now. So, <laughs> like an extra even, long weekend, isn't it? So. Even though I think we are post today, Oh, really? Well, I don't know. I didn't notice it when I came downstairs this morning. I mean, I set my alarm, so I was up at my normal time because I can't be doing with my body clock being out of whack just because the clock's going changing. So I set my alarm to yeah. down as normal. I came down at 8 and I didn't notice anything. And then next minute, about 10 o'clock, um, one of the boys comes through and says, oh, we've got post. I'm like, have we? I'm like, yeah, we've got post. So goodness knows what's happened, whether this went to somebody's house yesterday and then they're right, okay, they delivered it to the right address today. You might have gone to one of the neighbours, but yeah, we yeah. got post. So, That's weird. <laughs> but what I got on post was really, really good. Really, really Oh, okay. Good. So I got this off Ian at Parkwork Upgrades, which is the new um, sign he's done for the Titanic. Oh, lovely. There we go. Oh, the cat! It's got the captain on there. It's got the white star line. Yeah, and, and and the captain. And then it's also got created who it was done by. And then if you can see if it'll put it's because of the light, you know, it's not great. No, it looks good. It does say the day that um, it set sail and the day that it obviously um, sank. So, <laughs> but yeah, really, really good. I've got to do a video on that yet. Um, but yeah, yeah, fine. Yeah. So, couldn't believe it. Yeah, we had post. So, I don't know. Goodness knows what's happening. No. 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 We, didn't, we, we wouldn't get anything today. I, you know, I'm, I've been waiting for some stuff to come, and I can yeah. track it. But I know where it is. It's in the office. Just got to wait for it to be posted. Um, yeah. But, yeah, I had some, I had some bits right. turn up. We've so, got Thunder videos and stuff, so. Yeah. Well, go on in, Mark. So, we've got... We have got a couple of things tonight. Uh, the first thing is you want to talk about uh, the doll's house in France. Yeah, yeah. And, and we have another thing coming up, uh, which I'm all ready to go for, um, which uh, keep an eye out, guys. Um, moderators, we kind of need you watching because this could go pear shit, but hopefully it won't. But no. we'll go with what you want to talk about on the, uh, on the doll's house. Okay, yeah. Um, so, obviously... There was a lot of speculation of whether we would get the upgrade 
or not for the doll's house uh but they've just got it this past uh wednesday tuesday um france received issue 121 so they've got the extension now um so i would imagine um i don't see us not getting it at this point now uh it's right. done it in japan it's done it here um so it's more or less a green light for it to come out over here um but you start receiving your first parts for the uh, extension in issue 117 now this week is issue 116 this week so i'd imagine we'll find out about it this week or next um right. there'll probably be like a flyer inside about it because you start receiving the parts for it four issues before the end so <laughs> just to draw you in so yeah so yeah it's, it should it should be going um we'll find out we'll find out in a week or two if it's green if it's a proper go but it's it's gone it's gone in france it's gone in japan it's more than likely going to come out over here uh but there is two extensions so the first one is 80 issues that's for the winter and summer stuff mm. um and then after that there's an extra 60 issues and that is for the halloween stuff so it's 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 a it's a long build um yeah. if you do both extensions you won't finish the doll's house until 2026. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a long time. Um, yeah, and I, I presume with it being with subscribers, you would have to phone up Harsha and say, "I don't want anything else." Yeah, they're, they're, now I, I, they've done the extensions before on other, on other builds, and um, the last issue issue 119 and 120 you would get, normally get the two in the box because that's the last one but because there's an extension subscribers will still get issue 121 and 122 right. there's no way um of hashet cancelling that so if you cancelled it and you got those you would still receive those four parts and you would have to pay for those four parts yeah. um and then if you cancel it, you just wouldn't get any after issue 123. Um, just because you get, because the boxes are done now, they've done their four in issue, four issues in each box. They can't do it. So there's only just two in there uh, because yeah. of the logistics of doing that. It's just a bit whack. So it means that if you're a subscriber and you want to stop at issue 120, just ring them up and cancel it. But you will get the four issues. It also means um, you'll be waiting until the end of May before you get your issues and um, The end of yeah the end of May before you get your issues So people from the news agents will finish three weeks Before you get your next packet because of the four-week period sort of thing. Yeah uh, We'll know more for definite once we know about the extension Which is probably like this week or next but we'll know for certain but yeah because of how the box is you wouldn't be able to just ring up and say i only want the last two because yeah, how yeah. the box they'd yeah. have to give you the, the last four so you would have to pay for the extra two if you don't want to extend it mm. so um yeah it's the way they it's the way that their boxes is done it's the way that they've done it uh, obviously if they packed uh, more issues in the box it might have worked out better uh, but it's it's designed in another way i suppose to sort of get you in yeah to keep you going i mean they did a similar thing with the spitfire where um you would you'd finish the spitfire in the base by issue 100 mm. and then um 101 up to 120 was all the diorama pieces now that was included in the subscription that wasn't an extension but what you got in the spitfire was you got issue 99 100 101 102 so you got two issues of the diorama pieces. Yeah. But a lot of people just stopped at issue 100. And just yeah, stopped. yeah. I think a lot of, um, I've seen lots of people saying they're going to stop issue 120. Some people say they're going to continue it. Um, but yeah, if you're a subscriber and you think, oh, I'm just going to stop at 120, you'll still be charged and you will still get issue 121 and 122. So I just want to make people aware of that, just in case they say that they didn't want it. Uh, there might be a there might be a way though, 
in where you might be able to claim those two issues back by sending them back because you might be able to send them back and then they will refund you for those two issues. Um, we'll have to see what happens then. Yeah. Okay. Right, so I'm just going to go through some of this uh, chat, first of all, and then I'll do the next thing that I planned as a little bit of an Easter thing, really. Yeah, so, yeah. Okay, so I have started some of them, so I'm going to try and go through this as quickly as I can. Um, so first in tonight, we've got Spider Sprue saying, Hi, Mark and Kev and chat. Hope everything is good. So evening, Spider Sprue. Welcome. Hi, Spider Sprue. So everything is good here. We had a full row yeah. dinner, so... Full. Yeah, today, yeah, uh, the, the way to go. We've got Easter Sunday roast dinner. dinner. Well, I was cooking it while then, Mark was still in bed. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> Early riser. Uh, we've got Steve 131 who says, Evening all, evening, Steve. Hi, Steve. Uh, we've got D Harris says, A very good evening, Mark and Kev. Hi, D. Hi, D. Uh, we've got Spider Spruce saying, Hello, all on Kev's channel. <laughs> uh, channel jump. Saying good evening, Mark and Kev, and all in chat. So, evening, Dave Matt Builds. Hi, okay. Dave. Uh, we've got David Phillips in saying evening, all. Evening, David. Hi, Dave. Uh, we've got Scott Duggan in saying evening, all. Evening, Scott. Hi, nice, Scott. Uh, we've got Stephen Belcher in saying hi, Mark and Kev. Evening, Stephen. Hi, Stephen. Uh, and then Stephen says hi, all in chat. Is he going uh, through both? Mad Dad Hobbies in saying evening and happy Easter all. So evening, Mad Dad Hobbies. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got Ian, Ian Campbell in saying evening all. Evening, Ian. How are you? Evening, Ian. Um, we've got Kenneth in saying afternoon from Atlanta, Georgia. Kevin and Mark are incredible and amazing and has an amazing YouTube channel and my favourite YouTube people to watch. Happy Easter. Thank you, Happy Kenneth. Easter. Yeah, happy Easter. Happy Easter. Uh, Facebook user says happy Easter, Mark and Kev, and all in chat. So happy Easter. Happy Easter. Uh, Dave Matt <laughs> says happy Easter to you also, Mark and Kev. Uh, we've got another Facebook user saying happy Easter, Mark and Kev, and all in chat. <laughs> uh, Ian Campbell says, I remember as I had to wait a whole extra hour for this. <laughs> <laughs> Can't do all about that. I, can't, I, no. I don't know why we still change the clocks, but we do. Yeah, I don't really know why we still do all that. Obviously, yes, it was done years ago for farming and stuff like that, so I don't really understand why we still do it. But What I like now is because the USA, they changed their clocks forward eight, uh, a few weeks ago, beginning of Yes, that, they do, yeah. And we're doing it now. We're back on track with them in the time difference. Yeah. They have to keep adding an hour or deducting an hour and stuff. Yeah. So, uh, Paul Jordan's in saying happy Easter, Mark and Kev, and all in chat. Evening, Paul. Evening, Paul. Uh, then D. Harris says, can't beat a jar of Americano. No. No. So, it's, uh, yeah, I always get a nice coffee for a jar of coffee for Easter. So, uh, Steve131 says, at Mark's Mods, are you type 1 or 2? I'm type 2 diabetic. Um, it did go into remission, but then about... Six weeks ago, we found it had come back with a vengeance. So, oh. yeah, wasn't. Good. I, I had suspicions it it was back. Um, More tired. I was tired and a lot of other things and stuff and yeah, blood tests, normal diabetic blood test. Yeah, said it was back. So, just got to deal with it. Uh, Mad Dog Hobby says we had post today. So, I'm not the only one. That's <laughs> Yeah, maybe maybe they've been told they've got to clear it. I don't know, but we haven't. Yeah, and I'm, I'm, yeah I don't know what's going on. Dedication to the job. Steve one three one says says that's a nice Titanic sign. Well done, at Ian Campbell. So it's it lovely. Very nice. I'm yeah. going to do a bit. I'm going to take the old one off, but I'm going to have to do it with a hairdryer to release the sticky tape behind it. Yeah, not easy. <laughs> Uh, Spider Spruce says working on the Eiffel Tower uh, stages 80 to 89 at the moment. Oh, it's the optics yeah. and all of that. On that, yeah, oh. there's a lot of that. Uh... No, no, no. <laughs> uh, Paul Jordan says, Anyone got any older wish issues of X Wing? Happy to buy issues 94 and 98 
Wayne was good to give me his broken X-wing, so I'm after a few parts. Also, left underside wing piece and right lower plate piece. I haven't got any left over actually. Yeah, asking um, in the part in the groups. Mm. There's loads of people, even myself. I've got loads of it, it, like spare issues lying around. Loads of them. Yeah. I did the X-Wing, but I don't have any of the, um, I don't have any spare issues. I never had any spare issues from that build anyway, so. I mean, I've, I've not got, I didn't do that build, so I've got any spare issues. But I mean, I've got Alien spare issues, um, Terminator spare issues lying around. Yeah. Um, Tumblr, Doll's House, they're, they're all over the place. Um, I think I got rid of a lot of mine. I think I gave some away when I uh, moved because I just thought I'm not taking them with me because they're just going to take up space again. Yeah. So, I don't want to chuck them in the bin. This is the thing. Uh, but no one seems to want them. So I don't know what to do with them. Uh, we've got mum and son train rail fans in saying good afternoon, everyone. So hi, Tammy and Ray. Welcome hi, Tammy and Ray. Um, right. I'm almost caught up, would you believe? So Brian started. I, I'm wondering whether the clock's going forward has put has got people like messed up a little bit. And uh, D Harris says Mark is the mods on Kev's channel. Only one iPad tonight, right? Okay. So this Easter Sunday, so I came up with this idea of come and join us. So I'm going to put a link in for the live stream in the chat on both channels. So this is going into Kev's now. There will be a delay because she's slightly ahead on this one. And that's going into mine now. Come and join us. Come and have some fun till 8 o'clock. So, yeah. Uh, come and ask us what you want and anything. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure you've got a webcam mm -hmm. on so we can see you. And come on. We can have 12 on here. So we've got 10 places available for people to come on. So come and join us. Come and have a chat and have some fun for Easter Sunday because. Uh, it's been a bit quiet. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm going to show um, the Optimus Prime build. So that will be on yeah. my chat. There are three videos. They'll be on my channel this week. But that is what it looks like at the minute. Wow. So, yeah, it's bulked out. We've got the circuit board as well. Um, so when you get a lot of the parts, you kind of think there's not a lot there. But actually, when you start adding it, it's, I mean, that's the side of him. It starts bulking out quite a bit, so yeah, I'm happy with that. And we've now started on the on the shoulder as well, so there's the start of the left shoulder. Um, but yeah, I'm happy with that. And, and with the water slides on the back, these are water slides on the back here, water yeah. slide details. So uh, I was obviously a bit cautious about them, just like you said, Mark. Yeah. And um, actually, they've come out all right. They've actually come out pretty well. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah, I'm happy with that. So, one, person, one person in already, and that is uh, Mr. Ian Campbell. Hi, Ian. Hi, Ian. Hi, Ian. <laughs> How's it going? Yeah, going oh, good. You. Yeah, I've got I've got really bad internet signal problems. So um, if if I freeze or anything, I apologise. That's okay. How did um, how did London go? London was. Uh, it was really busy well then again Different. we did go on the saturday night um but yeah we we were a bit lazy i drove down there um yesterday afternoon and we got to the we park in the east end uh near yeah. canary Wall, and uh we just got an uber to take us into right outside the, the theater um and we did the same back rather than worry about all the tubes and everything but but back to the future yeah it never ceases to amaze it was fantastic yeah really good that's been going for a while now that has yeah, a good number of years now. Must be about yeah. four years, probably more. Yeah. Well, I know the well. workshop, he's been to see it about nine times, I think. That was my <laughs> second. <laughs> it must be good. Yeah, it really is. The the effects and everything. Special, I mean, if anyone's going, it is really good. They obviously have got a full-scale DeLorean car on the stage all lit up, and it does all this sort of moves and comes out into the audience and all that kind of stuff. It's really, really good. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna. Have to, I, I keep me, uh, meaning to go and see it, and but when I go to London, it's always to do other things. It's always to go elsewhere. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I know what it's I like in London. At night, so the right way. You can see my poorly uh, Yamaha up there still. Look. Still oh yeah. Uh, 
<laughs> I've not done Is it. it in two bits? It fell off the kitchen counter. Um, oh, right, okay. It, it's got quite a few bits to it now. A few it more parts a, to put on it, yeah. <laughs> it took a tumble. Yeah, you could say that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. Good evening, Paul. Paul. Hi, Paul. Hello, Paul. Hi, guys. <laughs> all right. <laughs> We're all in here tonight. Well, why not? It's Easter. Yeah, it's Easter. Why not? Yeah, get us all in. Um, no I don't know what. Stream. Um, Can you say hello. Oh, what live stream? Live stream. Uh, Drew's just come. Yeah, here's Drew. Here's Mrs. Hi, Partwork. Hiya. Hi, hi, <laughs> you all right? Yeah, you. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, she's just relaxing after a busy day of uh, dust covers and stuff. Queries. Oh, announcing queries. Yeah, we there's, oh, there's right, no okay. rest for us. Even on Easter holiday, we're still... Yeah, you've got busy. an Easter deal on as well, haven't you, at the minute? No. Hell, I've done one live stream. Don't talk about refunds and stuff. Go on. <laughs> right, you do it. You sort it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ian, maybe I can um, send you, I mean, I don't know whether you could use them, but I've got a load of spare issues here. I could maybe send them to you. Maybe you might be able to, I don't know, sell them on Partwork Upgrades or something. I was just, yeah, I was just listening um, that you've got, I'm more than happy to give it a go. Um, I've got, got loads of, like, the box is huge, and it's just got loads of just random spare issues that I've got gathered over the years. Yeah. The box is absolutely here. yeah yeah box them up send them up kev yeah okay yeah, but like i said i've well, got a fact, load in fact I, I think you know we probably ought to meet up anyway because i want to see the alien and what we can do for that so yeah probably yeah we'll have to yeah yeah we'll have to arrange that yeah definitely cool. fantastic so how are you paul yeah, yeah we'll have to arrange that yeah definitely <laughs> a bit of feedback from where someone's feedback yeah. Um, but yeah, I, anyone else waiting for bits to come? What are you all waiting for? Well, for me, everything. Get anyone waiting for bits to come? Yeah. I can keep hearing an echo. I can... Is anybody hearing that? Or is it just me? Oh, yeah, no, I, I turned the YouTube off, my other YouTube session. So it was me originally, yeah. but it won't be that. Right. Okay, no okay. problem. Yeah, no. Um, oh, can, I, can I be really cheeky and just do a bit of uh, advertising? Yeah, no, you go ahead. One of these, it's on my store. Oh, a nice mug. If nobody can, Paul Work Pizza can. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, had to get that in. Yeah, but uh, we, still, yeah. we still need to work out a way to get one to Wonderfest. I think the idea is probably go there myself and and hand deliver. That's an expensive pizza. A boys, yeah. a boys weekend. That's a very expensive pizza. You and uh, you and Wayne should go. Yeah, well, Esther mentioned she said I ought to go with him next year, and he thought, you know what, I might look into that, and uh, I can ensure he gets his pizza. So yeah, because uh, um, I think Wayne stays at Fields, doesn't he? Well, the actual events at the hotel. Doesn't he stay at the hotel? Oh, I don't know. I I thought he stayed with Phil. He might stay at the hotel, won't he? Hmm. Yeah, I, yeah, I'll, I'll have a chat with him. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty it, sure. I think the rooms go pretty fast, though, don't they? At the hotel where it's all done. Yes, it's like it's like the San Diego Comic Con for models. It's like the biggest yeah. thing going. I know so. the Hobby Time model guys. They they stay at the hotel where it's all done at. So. But for them, it's not that far, is it, really? <laughs> no. Yeah. The Todd, uh, Todd the and, uh, the yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff there, um, like the, um, the J5 and stuff. Johnny 5's there. They got a load of Johnny 5's there, apparently, this year, because there's a load of people making them. Yeah, I've uh, got Johnny Group, actually, on that one, um, on replicas for Johnny 5, but still no power. That, Oh, no, I thought that would be fantastic. It really would, wouldn't it? If we had a J5 part work. I'm pretty I mean, sure. No, that's a definite. Yeah, you I'm pretty sure they might be the point. Well, 
Well, yeah, I'm pretty sure they'll probably be looking into it because there's a lot, there's a potential there. Um, there's the guy over in, obviously, in America, Titanic Inc. They, um, he, he does the, the J5s. He does loads of different versions as well, loads of different scales. He's like the main guy. Um, but it's like when you look at it, it, it seems to be a pretty simple, well, I say that, pretty, pretty straightforward part work. But, yeah. Yeah. Um, you can 3D print them. Yeah, yeah. I know a lot of people that 3D print the full size ones as well. Yeah. So. I don't think I'd print a full size one because that would take forever. I would. You'd need one of those Wayne printers for those. Oh, yeah. The one that goes really fast because I'm going to say man, <laughs> those mass, the Massive printer. I was at his, a few weeks back when I met up with him. Um, it must be like two foot square, this. Uh, FLA printer he's got. It's huge, taking up corner of his workshop. Probably it takes up ten percent of his workshop. It's that big, you know. <laughs> That's why I think get rid of all the models. Went around there, so uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what. I have seen a really nice printer, and that is where um, you can print in multiple colours. So you, at the moment, obviously, most printers just print in the one colour, but they actually do ones now where you can have yeah. like six different colours, and you can three D print stuff proper made instead of having to paint or, or anything like that it's already yeah, they look good, don't they? They got do the look colors good. already in it i mean the, the technology is there it's just getting better and better and better so mm. and what that does is that brings the price down and then everyone can afford that them, them mm. printers are with the multiple filaments they're not the they're, yeah quite expensive yeah but then again these the printers that we've got i mean they were really expensive at one point and yeah. the price has come down but then i think what happened there was a lot of people bought the printers during covid and then uh, i've seen a lot of people getting rid of them i afterwards so i think like the market became a little bit flooded with them yeah that was um, it brought the price down that was the case for webcams in lockdown because everybody was having to do everything on zoom chats and everything the price of a a simple Logitech C920, which was before lockdown, was about 40 quid on Amazon. They were selling for like 120, 150 pounds during lockdown. And yeah. Hold on as well. Can you imagine that? Well, that went when we were back then it, during lockdown. It, what a crazy time. <laughs> well, no, well, I mean, I'm well, the, crazy. Do you remember the Zoom fails that went on during lockdown? Yeah, was everyone was on Zoom. People didn't know how to use them. And I love some of the Zoom fails that were going on. You don't get them anymore, but they were hilarious. <laughs> what people realising they haven't switched the camera off or something. I still get Zoom. I still I still go to Zoom meetings now. That's how we do most of my work. And <laughs> um, I'm doing other stuff while in Zoom meetings. So I don't know if I should say this. Sod it. I play the computer while I'm on a Zoom meeting. So I've got... So I've got... <laughs> The PlayStation in the background, I'm playing while I'm in a Zoom meeting down here. Uh, I, I kind of guessed that because I remember you did some graphics for the fan home group and you said, Oh, yeah, I whipped them up while I were in a meeting. And I'm like, Yeah, are you supposed to be present in the meeting? Not well, the thing is, the meetings that we have, you then get emailed a transcript of the, of the meeting. Yeah. So I just scanned the transcript afterwards. <laughs> There's been a few times when they've called my name and I've I've been doing other things and then I've gone oh yeah sorry that's me yeah <laughs> yeah so you so you've got to be half listening really Kev yeah you, you have you to be yeah. yeah yeah you do have to be half listening as well um, but yeah they always what happens is after the meeting they send you an email but they send you a transcript of what's been said I suppose it's for legal but um, I just read it afterwards the email so I know if I've missed anything. Yeah, yeah I, I, could, I could see a friend's moment there. So you're there gaming away in a meeting the next minute. So I agree, Kev, you're going to go and move to Yemen. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What? I double not... check. What? What? I didn't agree well, to that. Yeah, I fell asleep. If anybody had any disagreements about going to Yemen, put your hand up. Everybody well, put your hand up, Kev, apart from you. <laughs> you, Kev, you off to sort the pirates out, are you? Yeah, I think so, yeah. The late delivery of the part works. You're going to go and sort them out. Well, <laughs> oh, no, we have problems with pirates. Now we've got to stop the boats from crashing into things. Yeah. Yeah. That was that. What I'll tell you what, though, that was something that was 
that was going to happen. That was. You're surprised never, it doesn't happen more. It do, well, uh, the thing is, it does. Was, a lot, a lot of yeah, people. Yeah, I'm going to say it does. It does happen more, yeah. but not to that kind of scale. Um, and and no. I guess very fortunate that they had time to, you know, raise the alert to the to the authorities, and and they closed the bridge off. So, tragically, unfortunately, you know, there was what six workers on the bridge, but you know, it could have been a lot worse, couldn't it? Yeah, especially if it was done in the day as well. Yeah. Um, yeah. Obviously, because um, I don't know if anyone remembers, um, Hemel's famous, not just Big for explosion. making films, but obviously for Buntsfield as well. And I live in the state just opposite. And um, when that happened, I remember, you know, I was just, you know, I was only dating my wife back then. And we got right up close to it. And if that, that happened on a Sunday, uh, a Sunday night, and like Sunday early hours, like Monday, uh, sort of Saturday night sort of thing, Sunday morning. And But if that had happened on a Monday, those buildings that were right next to it that you used to have two, 300 people in were completely flat, yeah. just completely flattened. It would have been so much worse. From, from the explosion, also the shockwave and everything, that it actually the windows for it for quite a, an area were put out. Yeah, so well... Window the breakage Fujitsu, like they had the Fujitsu camera place up there, uh, which had like 500 staff in on a Monday. That was right on the back of it, and it absolutely just leveled. It just completely vanished. The building just vanished. And yeah. if that had happened on a Monday, it would have been there. Would have been, you know, there was no. This is the thing. There was no fatalities at all. But if it had happened on a Monday, it would have been thousands. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, I agree. Very a few years ago, yeah. when we had flooding and uh, the bridge in Tadcaster in Yorkshire um, collapsed. Now, to go across this bridge, it's, it was quite easy, but to do the detour, it took an hour detour around it. Okay, really bad. But then I realised there's a brewery that does John Smith's in Tadcaster and Foster's. And I'm like, what side of the bridge is that brewery on? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, it's on the proper side, so we're okay. But yeah, that, <laughs> yeah. and that took them forever to build that again. They had to do it like a temporary bridge, and then they rebuilt it. And yeah, wasn't great for the people that lived in that area. Yeah, the, well, well, with Buntsfield now, they rebuilt it, and now it's surrounded by a huge housing estate. They've built lots and lots of houses around it. So <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how that's happened, but it's happened. Yeah. Um, at one point, you weren't allowed to really build on a floodplain, but now they get away with it. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. That's why that's why there is flooding like it is. <laughs> yeah, no um, room for drainage anymore, is there? Nowhere for it to go. No, no, no. Um. So yeah, getting back onto the part works. So what is everyone delayed on? What is everyone waiting for delayed wise? Well, I'm definitely missing Oxmouth Prime. That's delayed a heck of a lot. Um, the Skyline is the only one that's been delayed so far. I've got a message on the portal saying it's been delayed. Yeah, I've got, I've got absolutely no idea what I'm delayed on. I just... just I, stuff I've, not, I, I, I've not kept up to date whatsoever with what I've got coming in and what issue I'm up to on things. I, they just take my money and the things come through as and when in the post. Yeah. And they're going through a big bar, pile of boxes because I just ain't got the time to look at them. So I'm sure I mean, there are delays. I think I'm a little bit behind on DeLorean, but I think I'm on the tracks. So I, I could cancel that at any point because I'm not interested in doing the train tracks, I don't think. So. Yeah, that's um, the, the extension at the end, isn't it, that? Yeah, yeah. Um, what are you doing, Ian, altogether? Um <laughs> I've, I've probably got about uh, Robocop, Batman 66, um, the DeLorean, E.T. There's probably a couple of others as well. As I say, I've, I've, they just take the money and I've lost complete track <laughs> over the years of what, I, of what I'm meant to be doing or what I was doing. But, you know, I, I, as you know, I've got a couple of my builds out with other people. They're doing it for me. Yeah, thankfully. yeah the Ferrari. The Le Ferrari, uh, the Lamborghini Aventador um, mm. is being done as well. And I'm sure by the time they those guys have finished them, I'll have something else for them if they want to do something else. So uh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. I've got yeah. um, Optimus Prime, 
the 66 Batmobile, uh, Nissan Skyline, uh, Enterprise, Knight Rider, uh, Doll's House, <laughs> uh, Tumblr. <laughs> there's a load. There's a like you, Ian. It's like I've, I get to a point where I've built everything and then nothing's here, and then all of a sudden everything sort of comes in. It's like, oh, yeah, bloody hell. <laughs> got to yeah. do all this. <laughs> when, when we get, you know, it's always about the second week of the month. We, we tend to have raw mail pull up with a big van and there's loads of part work distribution boxes piled in the hallway. We've probably got 30 boxes up there now uh, waiting <laughs> to be dealt with tomorrow. So it, it, it's going to be a manic post run tomorrow. Or Tuesday when we get them to del yeah. deliver it. Or, or collect yeah, it'll be again. Tuesday now because it's bank holiday again tomorrow, <laughs> isn't it? Mm. I think I've got nine part works ongoing. So I've got Titanic, <laughs> Enterprise, Lancaster, Camper, Mura, Optimus Prime, U96, DeLorean, and Doll's House. Right. Yeah, there's. Um, I remember what do you remember years ago when there was only one or two part works we were doing and you know <laughs> now look at it yeah i think you're all averaging seven to nine each yeah yeah i think most people average that now i mean i can't i mean apart from wayne i don't see anybody else building so many he's doing wayne, wayne's, uh, he's got a uh, last i heard he had about 23 but i think it's more than 23 on the go and also we've it? just had he's just had that call of selling off yeah. 12 in it, 12 completed builds but he had more than 12 because he had already promised them to some of the others to other people mm. um I, I took a couple off his hands i took the uh, cobra and the delorean he'd built paul you had the millennium falcon yeah and a broken x-wing uh, and the x-wing that had been outside for a few winters yeah yeah <laughs> that's right and also everyone else sort of you know when you two guys did did advertise it you know yeah. a few weeks back they just gone you know it went so quick yeah yeah we were we were happy to help with that we liked that actually we said afterwards <laughs> didn't we uh, mark yeah, that we actually really like doing that and no, we no, want to do it again <laughs> i did i said to wayne i spoke to wayne after and i said look you know that was really good i said we, we'd sold quite a lot of them up to that point and then you you two sort of took the reins and went through all of the list but by the time you'd finished doing that they, they were gone and i yeah. said to wayne i spoke to wayne and said you know next time because you, you you both said oh we could probably do this as an option so, okay yeah let's mm. do that you know, yeah so next time because he, he's going to be in this position again yeah. you know when, he, oh, when yeah. he needs to call a load of his completed bills we'll put them up for auction and see how it goes if you two are happy with that oh, yeah we're happy yeah that was good fun i mean yeah that, right that night really did test the knowledge which company was doing it the name of them and everything but yeah it was good fun we got most of them done, but I'm, I I think uh, Wayne mentioned, I think, in his live stream, he said they went within like 30 minutes of us doing the stream on on Sunday. They went, yeah, I, I went to see him on the Sunday. I, I saw him on, I, actually, I think it was the Saturday morning, or was it the Sunday? I can't remember which now, but yeah, I put them up on the site. I did a, a special page for his stuff yeah. so people could buy them, and a few of them went. Um, yeah, and then, yeah, by the end of Sunday evening, they were... Yeah, some, so, oh, I remember so seeing the post. Yeah, I saw the post on Parkwork Facebook page. I think it was like Sunday midday, afternoonish sort yeah. of thing. Yeah. And then I we I mentioned it to Mark. Mark looked it up and went, "Oh yeah, look, he's he, should we should we mention this on the stream?" I went, "Yeah, let's do it." Mm. Oh, yeah. That was it. After when you aired it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, quite... I mean, absolutely. You know, ninety-nine quid for a, a completed build, which typically would be like twelve. Oh yeah. Quid. You know, I said at the time, didn't I? I said absolutely, it's a no-brainer. That I said the Millennium Falcon. I can't believe that's still there. <laughs> I've got to go. uh, but yeah, hundred pounds for. It's a. You know what I mean? It's no yeah, brainer. And, and a build you've got the complete build history to it. You've actually got all the YouTube yeah. channels, all the, you know, yeah. ones wayne's wayne's done video recording and you can go back and watch the whole thing you own the one that you've seen built as many as all the other thousands that have yeah so. we said about wayne doing little plaques for him to say you know i built this sort of yeah. thing and some of it off yeah, in the fields uh, authenticity uh certificate or something <laughs> yeah 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 there's a car yeah, there's actually we should be talking about it there's um there's a show a car show happening in london um 
this I think it's this the end of this month or May. Um and the guy that was the, the guy who owns the the Nissan Skyline, the GT the GT Skyline that we're building is gonna be there. And I was thinking it'd be a great way to go and get the bonnet signed. Mm. by the guy who actually owns the car and was on the show and every, uh, on the film when it was on. Yeah. Um, so I think there's a link somewhere. I'll have to post that link somewhere. Um, but, yeah, he's going to be there with a lot of – it's like a Fast and Furious thing, and oh. he's going to be there. I thought it might be quite good because I know a lot of people um, got their DeLorean um, signed when um, Doc Brown was, was at a convention and he was signing – Signing the bonnets and stuff for people. Oh, Mr. Lloyd himself. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. He was doing a convention. I think it was, um, I think it was MCM in London and people took their DeLorean hoods down and he was signing them. Because there yeah. are, there are websites you can actually send your stuff into and they, they yeah. do sessions where, where the, the guys, you know, Christopher Lloyd, etc., would sit and do signings for a, a, a fixed amount of money. Say, yeah, yeah, and they'll send it back to you. So, I've considered it, but to be honest, they—I think they want a bit too much money for a signature. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. You know, we know we know about the like. I think a lot of people do it because they think it increases the value. Um, um, I, I don't think it does, yeah. but uh, that's just me. People did that, and then they were flogging them on eBay for about two, three hundred quid. Yeah, I think it could help more. Um, in getting your, if it like for us, getting this site over and, and giving an impression that, you know, here's such and such from the director of the Back to the Future holding one of our parts. I think Chloe does it and it looks really good. I think she had the um, Christmas tree or something. Oh, the, yeah. The flux capacitor Christmas tree. Yeah. Yeah, I think I saw a picture of it. So I think it has its benefits in that sense, but I don't think oh, it yeah, really yeah. Value to, to your own personal. I'm product. surprised actually. In talking with like doing YouTube, I'm surprised no one's used. Um, um, is it um, cameo? Is that what it's called? Where you can you pay a fixed fee for a celebrity and they do like a video, a little shout out. I'm surprised no one. I'm surprised no one's used that. <laughs> yeah, it's called um, it's called cameo. If you type it in, you find it all out, and all the celebrities are on there, all different fees, but. You can do a video message from someone, and I'm I'm surprised no one's done it, sort of as an adduction to their the YouTube yeah. channel. Yeah. Um, okay. But yeah, they've well, got loads of they've got loads of actors on there: English, British, American, Australian, everything's on there, all with different fees. And then I think they they do like a like um, a forty second video, and I'm surprised no one's used it actually to do their channel. Like, come and watch. The, Come and watch the you like the Nexus and all this well, sort of thing. I mean, I uh, obviously when you watch Wayne's channel, there's always the Christian from Grantham, yeah, the jingle that he does. And I had that. I, I mean, I found a, a similar site where you can get actors do, that do voiceovers, proper like yeah. radio presenter kind of kind of thing. And yeah, only about twenty quid, fantastic price for like thirty seconds. So that's where that kind of came from. Um, we keep saying we're going to do another one because you know, not not get to get rid of christian from it but put, add another jingle in there at some point of something else you know so yeah yeah like i said but yeah have a look at it. it's called um cameo i cameo. think it's called I'm gonna, yeah that down, actually. yeah cameo. Um, <laughs> and you could get you could get anyone i think there's people from only falls and horses on there um and then they've got the bigger ones as well they've got the big old guys as well. they've got politicians on there as well um Oh, yeah. that, uh, you know, if, if you could have got Uncle Albert doing something about in, in, introducing the Titanic now, wouldn't have that been really, really good? We're in the war, yeah. We're in the war, <laughs> considering every boat he's ever been on is sinks. Um, you know. yeah. <laughs> what, during yeah. the war, we were on an icebreaker and we pushed this iceberg <laughs> into the Atlantic Ocean by accident. Yeah. yeah. Don't know what weren't weren't he a chef on one of the... I'm sure he was a chef on one of the boats. And he was... <laughs> Yeah, funny. Well, but yeah, they're all on. But like I said, they're all on there, and, and they're all different prices. And you pay it, you pay the price, and then they they record the video and they send it to you. And I'm just yeah. surprised that no one's used it to do something for YouTube. Um, I'm going to look into it. There might be an opportunity there for me somewhere. But yeah, 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 you, yeah. Lots of people um, use it for their friends and stuff. So 
you know, the love, some celebrity saying happy birthday. They've asked me to ask you, so I say happy birthday. And it's like a, a, a video thingy. But yeah, yeah, people use it for like YouTube and stuff. So I'm surprised no one's used it for part works. Like, got, yeah. say, say the Optimus Prime. I know Peter Cullen's on there. Like, getting actual the voice of Optimus Prime to, to overdo your start of the video sort of thing. Yeah. Wow. I've just, uh, yeah, I've never, I've just, thought it would be something different if you know what i mean it's a bit different and to have the actual actors there saying it as well it's quite cool yeah i'm just going to drop off I, I need to sort my throat out i've got quite a dry throat so i should be back on but i guess there's plenty of chat to, to read out yeah, I'm gonna yeah, yeah start going through the yeah. chat okay right so um d harris says evening mr c uh, Ken says, I'm on part three of the Agora Transformers G1 Optimus Prime and working on the fingers. Yeah, that's, um, I think most people are now on their last pack of that. It's coming to the end, isn't it, if you're on the yearly subscription? Yeah, pack 12, I think most people would have, if you're on the 12 pack stage, I think that I think it's coming this week or this next couple of weeks. Uh, D. Harris says he was first to the bar. He was happy, lol. Well, that's with Ian <laughs> going down to London. Yeah. Uh, D. says evening, Julie. Uh, we've got Kevin and Mary who says hi, everyone. Evening, Kevin and Mary. Hi, Kevin and Mary. Uh, Terry Martin says a bit late tonight, but evening all. Evening, Terry. Terry. Uh, Spanish Bruce says still waiting for pack two on bat 66. Should have got my. Pat six of Optimus yesterday, but DPD Germany decided not to deliver. Yeah, that's DPD for you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, D. Harris says the part work option live stream was good. Thank you, yeah. D. Uh, we've got Kev's Plastic Scales in, says, I'm having problems with the Lotus 970. It's been in processing for seven weeks now, and that's for pack three. I'm getting very dis uh, disappointed with Diagostini. There's been a few delays, I know, on that um, yeah. on the uh, Lotus. Yeah, I think there's there's a delay as well with the um, the Shelby Mustang, the the one six scale one, the big one. Yeah, because that's, that's not on, that's that on Gostini's website anymore in the UK. No, uh, but also I've noticed some people have been saying there's big delays, and in France as well, where they're building it, they've also experienced mm -hmm. quite a big delay with that as well. So I don't know what's going on with Diagostini at the moment. Mm -hmm. uh, Spider Spruce says, Titanic, Knight Rider, uh, Eiffel Tower, BR, Dean Frame, Rootmaster Bus, Optimus, Bat 66, and Gauntlet. R2D2 is finished, but still got to upload to my channel. Wow. Yeah, I think like I think like what um like John was saying, um I think there's like I think the average is like yeah. seven or eight builds now most people are doing yeah seems to be the way uh kev plastic scale says the first pack were received the beginning of november the shelby is fine coming through no oh, okay uh we've got alone in the dark says i almost got the hood signed by the guy who voiced kit yeah that'd be uh, cool and then d says i can hear all bra all the brains ticking over time <laughs> Would you believe I caught up on chat again? Oh, that's all right. Like I said, I don't think I think with the time change, I think a lot of people have like yeah. are not on tonight, so we did the old people come on. Yeah. Um, but I, yeah, but I don't think I think like I said with the with the time change, it messes everything up, doesn't it? Really. Yeah, it does. But it was just you know Easter Sunday. Why not? Let's have yeah. A have people on and it's, it's great to see faces as well because you don't always see i mean i'm up to I'm see paul tonight saturday. okay uh mark so i said again bradford next saturday oh are you yeah down at the cedar court hotel with a mitochondrial um mission um charitable right, oh, right. nice raised awareness and raising money for research and i'm middle of doing three paintings for them to work. so yeah so where are you oh, located Paul, in the uk I'm birmingham you're in birmingham wow okay. so i'll be traveling up on the saturday day 
uh, get and check in. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're not you're not too far from either of us, really. I don't think. How, how far are Birmingham from you, Mark? Two hours. Yes, yeah, about. Well, it's a, these are cool. So yeah, yeah, about two hours. Um, it's yeah. about an hour and a half from here, um, even on the train. So yeah, I go to I go to Birmingham because. Um, I go to the NEC because they do a lot of conventions at the NEC. So, yeah. Sorry, I, I just found out we've got a Huddersfield Comic Con on the 8th of June, which I'm going to. Yeah. There's a lot of them about at the moment, I've got to say. Yeah. So, we go, we go, I don't know if anyone is near Milton Keynes, but they have got one in May that I'm going to go to. So, if anyone's around the area at the time, I'll be going there on the Friday. I think it's like the 3rd of May or something like that. So if anyone's about on the Friday, the 3rd of May, and wants to meet up in Milton Keynes, you're more than welcome to say hello to me, because I'll be there. But they've got a um, well, they've got a convention in the shopping centre there, which they used to have years ago, and they've brought it back. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. did, did you know that I'm slightly off topic from, from the conventions and that? Yeah. Mr. Jordan here has a, a one one scale Terminator in his house. Wow. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> have, you, have you got that? Thanks. <laughs> Is that from uh, Sideshow? No, it's actually 3D printed. Oh, what? Oh, wow. <laughs> Wow. It, was, it wasn't us, by the way. So we're not <laughs> accepting orders or anything like that. <laughs> <laughs> My mom and it's a see it on facebook marketplace and ironically it was being sold um only locally from where i live where i used to where i grew up in castle bromwich in birmingham so i knew exactly where it was i used to live a road away so i rang him up straight away he went have you got it you went yeah i said i'll be around now with the money and <laughs> i got it for a steal i mean really yeah. and it's absolutely incredible Fully, based because the 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 half scale hash it, full size. Yeah. Mm. I mean, balls on and a battery pack and everything. The lot. It's it's, it's brilliant. That's that is amazing. That is. Yeah. Got, uh, Cat Walker from uh, Master Replicas as well in the living room, so, and Studio Scale Millennium Falcon, and Boba Fett ship which is signed by jeremy bullock um, wow. oh you've got some nice really nice pieces it sounds like yeah. yeah and i was working hard and before all the things with the mitochondrial disease um yeah i earned money and bought my collection so yeah uh, what, i you know i live by one of my dad's mantras which is you can't take it with you when you go so spend it now very true very true so you know i'm I'm, I live by that as well. You know, you can't take your money with you when you go. So spend it now. Oh, wow. Actually, this this may be a terrible time to say, based on that comment, we've got a, a discount code of fifteen percent. So if you've got anything to spend, <laughs> the code is Easter. Yeah, <laughs> there it is at the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> but my, my but, yeah. Theory yeah you can't take it when you go but my theory is when you go your kids can sort it <laughs> yeah. i i always say when, when when i go out for meals with people they go oh you eat a lot i said it's all right i'm not carrying the coffin yeah <laughs> <laughs> well, well said i'm above ground yeah 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 <laughs> but um yeah yeah i say that but yeah my dad my dad's always like uh, he says things like that. he says you know you, you know you can't take it with you you know yeah. live live in the moment spend it now because you, you can't take it with you you know yeah. so Absolutely. Mm. yeah <laughs> leave that one there but um yeah what's um that's the thing I mean, though, as an adult you get to play out your youth really that you couldn't do yeah. as, a, as a child totally totally so, agree yeah great yeah there's um yeah when it's you know you, you sort of when you're a kid you wish for sort of these sort of things and now you 
as an adult, we can actually get them and buy them and do them as well. And yeah. obviously, part works has helped with that because there's, I mean, there's some of the part works I never thought I'd ever do. Oh, so that's just got my attention mm. straight away. <laughs> Whoa, Is that man. a master replica one? No, it's a cheap one from Amazon, 50 quid. <laughs> what? That's all right. <clears throat> Yeah, mine are in storage in my loft at the moment. <laughs> yeah, my daughter's got what well, I did have the FX ones that um, were old that I think Hasbro brought out years and years ago. They go for quite a bit of money now, but my daughter's got them now. She confiscated them, so she has all, all the locket savers in her room. So, but I did have them all at one point, and they all make the noise, and that, you hit them together and they make a noise as well. Yeah, so, great fun. Great fun. Um, the ones that they originally done, and then, as you say, they went over to Hasbro, didn't they? The um, yeah, and they've just gone up and up in up in price of now. You're talking what about three hundred pound? Oh, of them, yeah, some of the original ones that they did, yeah, yeah. And then you got a master replicas. They did um, sort of well, proper proper ones with the, the lightsaber on it, but also just the handles as well. Mm. I've got all them. <laughs> <laughs> Trouble is, though, but, lightsabers now, you've got uh, all the colours in the rainbow to go for. Uh, yeah, they've got lots that I know. Um, my daughter's asked for uh, a Suka ones. They do a double one. Yes, yeah, lovely. She, want, she wants that. So we're looking at getting her that. Uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, they're not. In the chat. It looks like Todd's been caught out with the time difference. But hi, Todd. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. It's just, it's just joined. <laughs> uh, dang it, time change. I, missed the I did say, I did say, I did, I did think that the time change would, because obviously they, like Mark said, they've had their time change uh, months ago, weeks ago. Yeah. And we're now caught up with them, so. Oh, dear. But yeah, we're coming to the end now. Yeah, it's been fun. Real good. Yeah. It's great to yeah, it's nice that. coming on. When are you going to start doing blueprint mugs? Oh, <clears throat> yeah, I, I've been, been meaning to, to, I mean, obviously I've got the blueprints, I've got the mugs, I've got, I've got the machine to print them on. It, it's, it's like every, he's, he's doing it. There's not enough around. time in the day, is there? This, this is the problem. <clears throat> this is the problem. If I, if I could pack up my day job, and, and if I don't know, my day job isn't part work upgrades, but if, if yeah. I could pack up my consultancy job, my main job, and just concentrate on part works, I'd have the time. Um but it's just yeah. not quite in that position. I wish I could. No, that's the same. A lot of people have asked me before, do you do YouTube for a living? I'm like, no, no, I, I can. With the benefits that I get from working as well, like the pension and the security and stuff like that, I don't think I could ever leave it because I think YouTube is a bit unsecure. Yeah. yeah. Nothing certain. With yeah, it. you're reliant on their policies and their changes and it could have a, a massive impact in what they decide to do. Yeah. yeah and then it's not like i said you only need to i mean at the moment if i'm ill i get sick pay yet with youtube if you don't load, load videos they stop paying yeah. um yeah. you know so there's there's, there's yeah. benefits to working over youtube so and i do this i mean we all do this for fun anyway don't we you know it's not yeah, but if you were to break your wrist or something and you can't build your models and you're not able to release videos yeah and it does drop off quite a bit as well. I've noticed when you stop releasing videos, that it drops like, like a cliff. So because of the algorithm, because of how it's designed, it's it's designed in a way where you they want more content from you. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. To, to keep your stats and, and everything up, you've got to keep going at it. Yeah. I mean, obviously, if there was the security there, I would I would do this and the money there, obviously. But it's just not there. It's just not there. I don't think it ever will be as well. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I just like I said, I I don't think I'd ever do this full time as a job. It just it, doesn't pay. It's fun, and when the fun stops, then yeah, stop. That's exactly it, Mark. Yeah, yeah. Right, I'll just catch up with this chat before we uh, get gone. Um, okay. So Kev Plastic Scale says the being quiet could be due to YouTube as your stream was tagged. <clears throat> To start at 6 p.m., it could be the clock change that's caused the issue, guys. Right. Yeah. Yeah. 
Uh, D says Paul show and tell time. <laughs> uh, yeah, Paul, sorry, Paul. Paul, you'll have to come on again, but this time you'll have to take your camera and show us the, the Terminator. Yeah, you're going to have to go around showing us all the bits, Paul. Give us a tour of, of the inside and the workshop. I have them down <laughs> app. So obviously I'm kind of looking at a very small screen on my yeah. phone. Yeah. 16 to telly. You're looking at me kind of thing, so that's why I'm doing yeah. it. Oh, uh, right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so D says, yeah, can't take it with you. That's because the missus already got it. <laughs> um, and then Todd says, uh, boom, you've got to go another hour. LOL. <laughs> <laughs> and then Dave Matt says, I do my build seven days a week. Oh, right. Well, that's it. Yeah. Well, that's been enjoyable tonight. Yeah, it's been all right. Yeah. It's nice for Ian and, and uh, Paul to come on. It's nice to have you on, guys. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, guys. Thank yeah. You. Thank you very much. Um, we'll be back again, same time, same place next week, 7 p.m. UK time. Goodness knows what YouTube says, what time it is, and goodness knows what YouTube, what time it is in the other world, because I always get it wrong. So yeah. We'll be um, all right next week. It takes a week for it to catch up. So <laughs> Yeah, something like that. All in chat. Happy Easter to you all. Thank you. Yeah, happy Easter, everyone. Okay. So thank you, Ian, for coming on and uh, oh, showing us everything. And, Paul. Uh, and thank you, Paul. Yes, we want to see the uh, life-size Terminator next time. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> definitely. I'll just and, pop. Um, Lee, you yeah. got to your channel yeah. if you want me to. <laughs> we'll try. Yeah. Great. <laughs> yeah. Definitely. Right. So, Kevin, have you got all coming up this week? Uh, there's a lot. There's a lot. There's, um, I've got three videos out tomorrow and probably three videos out on Monday. But, yeah, Optimus Prime, 66, Bat and Bill, all that sort of stuff. Six, you know, Tumblr, Doll's House, usual stuff. Okay. Just um, normal stuff on my channel, really. I'm more or less caught up with the Enterprise, um, and most things are now on the weekly schedule. So I'm back to normal, thank goodness. Well, so, um, yeah, so it, okay, yeah. Just it. I've been Mark. I've been Kev. Ian Paul. Ian. I will catch you all next week, guys. Yeah. Bye. See you later, guys. Bye. Bye. Cheers. Bye.